So this is the lobby of our hotel and it's all decorated for Christmas. It's kind of super early in the morning. Um, but yeah, we're just going to get ready and go for some breakfast in that restaurant there. We've got some free vouchers um, with our booking through Virgin. So we get two free breakfasts and one free dinner um, at the Plaza Garden restaurant. So yeah, that's where we're going for breakfast this morning. So this is my breakfast. Eggs, sausage, bacon and a pancake, an orange juice and some coffee. Yep, that's all I've got, but it looks tasty so I'm going to dig in. We're just heading into Universal Studios for the first time of the trip. Came in yesterday. We did, but we're going we through the actual gates. <laughs> yeah. Palace Arcade long sleeve top, which is awesome for like half price. Uh, Killer Clowns from Outer Space candy bar purely for the packaging for two dollars. And you got like a journal, Stranger Things. Yeah, it's, um, it's like, like a, a like a diary, really, isn't yeah, it? For next year though, which was seven fifty on sale, so it's like twenty seven dollars for everything with tax, which is really amazing for that stuff. I didn't expect it. I think it's like running late to get rid of some I think stuff. It's only just started because I heard people yesterday um, in saying that they were in there yesterday and it was still full price because they were moaning about buying a cup. Oh wow, so it did well. But um, we're going to go maybe on another attraction or ride or something now. So, um, we've just got off Fast and the Furious. So I think all the rides we've done so far this morning have been simulator rides. And the problem with Universal for vlogging is you can't be, like film any of the rides. So it's kind of kind of boring when you just like film and say, oh, I've been on this and oh, I've been on that. But there, that's what we've done. So we're just getting another freestyle Coke machine thing. And then we're going to be going over into Harry Potter because big Harry Potter fans. And this is the first time we've done Diagon Alley on this trip. So yeah, we're going to go there and you've got a drink now. What did you get this time? Root beer. You got root beer. I needed a root beer. I don't like root beer, so I'll have to wait until this is drunk before I can get another one. Yeah, that's um, that. But at I least we, we're doing that. Yeah, we can have a little bit of a sit and then yeah, we're going to go into Diagon Alley and have a look around there. Diagonally. Diagonally. I keep, kept what it was so, oh, yeah, I lost a 
Yeah, we've only read the books a hundred times. Here we go.
Hello. We're back at the room. That was a. I don't know when we last filmed. Cowfish, I think. Cowfish, uh, which was amazing, by the way. We went there and had a cheeseburger sushi thing and a short rib burger. And the pickles, it was a lot of food as well. Um, but it was really, really nice and well worth going if you're thinking of going to Cowfish when you're at Universal Studios or whatever. I, I would definitely recommend it. Would you recommend it? Yeah, it was really, really tasty. It was really tasty. So we went to the international premium outlets after that on International Drive. Uh, so we could go to the Disney outlet and Bath and Body Works. We also went into another shop and I got a Funko Pop of Michael Scott from The Office, which was amazing. And then I spilled juice all over it. Yeah, so I've unboxed it, uh, which we unboxed them anyway, so it's fine. So when I, th I don't think we'll show the things we've got. You can just show the bags. I'll show the bags, but I'm not, I think we'll wait to show the main things. The Bath and Body Works, it's amazing. It smelled great in there because they've got all the uh, holiday stuff out. And we've got two big Disney bags. Um, there was a few bits we bought, but we'll do a haul. Um, obviously like everybody does after a uh, Disney slash uh, Orlando trip so we'll, we'll wait to show it all in the hall and then we called it Walgreens on the way home and we got some Mike and Ike's um, we're just showing my forehead I think Mike and Ike's 10 flavor Mega Mix um, and some dill pickle Lay's because we don't get dill pickle Lay's it just kind of tastes like salt and vinegar Lay's yeah. uh, because we're on holiday and we just don't eat, we don't get to eat like this at home. We've been really saving ourselves. I'm, I've probably gained a few pounds already, but whatever. And some milk duds, which every single time I've been to the US, I've bought milk duds. Yeah, milk duds It's awesome. a thing, they're amazing. Uh, and a couple of zero sugar Gatorades. But now we're watching Smackdown, because uh, we like wrestling. And then we're gonna go to sleep soon, because it's quarter past eight, because we're animals. <laughs> We're, we're party animals, uh, but we've been, you know, we've been up since like five, so we're quite uh, sleepy or tired. We didn't so. get to film a much after cowfish because it's been raining. No, it's been raining since about three, four o'clock. So once we got out of cowfish, it was raining, and we were on a bus and stuff to get to international uh, outlets, and then it, we just it was quite busy there, so we just didn't get to film. Um, once we get to our Disney days, there'll be probably a lot more filming than there is here because we can't do, can't film on the rides or attractions at Universal really. We'll wrap up today. That's our second full day done. I'll quickly pass you over so Victoria can say goodnight and... Yeah, just uh, turn it towards me. Oh. Night. Night. <laughs> we'll see you tomorrow. I think tomorrow is SeaWorld. So yeah, we'll see you then.